everyone, how is your day going? I hope it's going well, no matter what you're doing. If you're new here, my name's Melanie and I do a large variety of different types of videos. I do everything from beauty box unboxings, story times, trying things on camera for the first time, experience videos, small business hauls, food hauls, random hauls, concert type videos, vlogs and so much more. Today's video is an unboxing of my most recent order from Noah. If you don't know, Noah sell candles, wax melts and home goods. Predominantly candles and wax melts, they started with candles, they also do wax melts. I prefer the candles and predominantly, well, made, well, mostly do buy the candles over the wax melts, but I do buy the odd wax melt every now and then. So about a week and a bit ago for me as i'm filming this there was the relaunch of the website with a restock and the valentine's range when it all went on sale it was when i wasn't well and i forgot to go on on the day that the valentine's collection was launched and i didn't go on for I think two days later, now the Valentine's collection wasn't massive, it was a candle, a wax bar and a wax burner or you could buy the set where all three were in. Now I don't need the wax burner because I have something very similar so I was just going to get the candle but by the time I went on all that was left was the wax burners and the wax bars so I did buy something else as well because obviously I'd planned to buy the candle at the bare minimum so it arrived yesterday for me so six days after I ordered and I'd actually forgot about it so it was a nice little surprise all I've done is took the address put the label off so let's open it and get into what I've actually got A little thank you card with personalised message on. She actually knows I've been ill, so it just says feel better soon, my lovely. She's such a lovely person. And these are the new thank you cards. How nice are these? The picture is absolutely stunning. And on the back it just says thank you so much. By supporting our small business, you are not only keeping our dream alive, but are helping us grow. We wouldn't be here, we wouldn't be where we are today without wonderful customers like you we hope you love our product we hope you love the products as much as we did of creating them love natasha these are really high quality cards because i was going to buy the valentine's candle i decided because i couldn't get it i would buy another candle so i saw this was on sale or on offer because they're reformulating it so I clicked on it, I was like, oh, I wonder what rest, I wonder what rest smells like because I've, I don't have it. And then I read the description. I don't know if I knew and forgot, but rest used to be called nap time. Now, if you know anything about me, you know nap time is one of my top five favourite scents. And I, I for some reason got it in my head that it be, had been discontinued because there was quite a few scents that got discontinued some of my favourites so because I never saw nap time in the listings I must have just presumed that it'd be discontinued which it hadn't been it'd just been renamed but now she's reformulating it so is it going to smell the same I don't know I mean I hope it does so I think this was on offer for about £11 when normally it was even 9 or 11, I can't remember, but normally it's about £14 or something like that. This is the medium one. So, as soon as I saw it, I was like, I'm going to have to get it because I don't believe I've got any nap time. If I do, I might have a large nap time. Do you know how I, I don't use all the candles and I hold some back? So if there is a nap time around anywhere, if there is a nap time anywhere, I don't know I've got it, which is probably a good thing because... I didn't know it was still available 
obviously she's renamed it and smelling this now it reminds me how much i miss rest it's just stunning i'm actually glad to discover that it's just been renamed and i must have known when she got rid of some when she discontinued some she did rename a couple because ground used to be called forest so obviously she's renamed it and i've just forgot and i've not bought it thinking that she doesn't do it anymore so i've finally got it back this is not the valentine's one so i'm guessing this is a freebie because i'm a club member and all club members got a free wax bar but i know the free wax bar isn't this one it's another one that's in the box so i don't know what scent this is but it's got rose petals in it and it's absolutely stunning now this might be a scent that she's going to launch. I don't know. I've not smelt it. I can't tell you what it is yet. Well, I can tell you it's a really stunning scent. I don't even know how to describe this one. It's kind of got a fruit scent to it, but it's also got like a floral undertone. That is really stunning. I like that a lot. I actually really do like that one. So I have that. And I believe this one... If you're not a club member, you just got a sample of this. If you're a club member, you got the full wax bar. So this is fluorescence, fluorescence, botanical wax soy, botanical soy wax bar. Again, this has got rose petals in as well. And can you see that it's slightly coloured? she's not coloured it sometimes the oil, fragrance oils some of them are darker than others if the wax bar stays pure white it means it's a very light oil but if it's slightly coloured like this is kind of almost a, a, almost a very very pale orange it's because of the fragrance oil again i don't know anything about this scent but i know that non-club members got a sample and club members got the full bar so let's have a little smell and I like that one as well. It reminds me of, do you know, like a really classic perfume scent, but not strong. Do you know, like a Chanel Number no. Five or Chanel Mademoiselle kind of scent, but not as strong and not as like fiery, because they're quite fiery strong scents. But it does have a bit of a perfume scent to it. But yeah, it's kind of got a, not a heavy perfume scent, but it's kind of a classic perfume scent but like but it is a very pretty fragrance that i think a lot of people would like now the wax bar that i did buy is this one amar amor amare this is from the valentine's collection and this is the scent for the valentine's collection now i believe the scent from last year is the same scent i have a feeling that I've still got the candle from last year because last year she did a candle and wax brittle and you could buy them individually or as a pair and I remember buying buying them as a set and I remember using the brittle and because it was quite a strong floral scent I just ended up using the brittle and not the candle so I'm going to find the candle because I've got a good feeling that I kept it I actually wanted the candle from this year just because Last year's candle jar was a really pretty pink, but this year's candle jar is a really dusky pink and it's stunning. But I still have the wax bar and the candle somewhere. So I did so I did miss out, but I've got the candle anyway, so I'm gonna find it and start burning it. But look how pretty the back of the wax bar is. I'm gonna have a little smell anyway, even though I'm pretty sure. I can remember the scent because it is quite a heavy floral and I'm not the biggest heavy floral fan yeah it's kind of like kind of a dry musky floral scent really nice but yeah it's quite a strong one but again such a nice one and something that I wouldn't typically pick anyway and I think it's good to get scents that you don't normally choose do you know like if you buy something you've never had it before and you go on the scent description and you 
it arrives and you smell it, you're like, oh, I wouldn't have bought that if I knew what it smelled like, but I don't mind it. So, yeah, that's what I bought. I love the pink label. So that's my little order that I treated myself to. Until she does a really big restock and introduces some new products, I can't imagine I'll be doing a, a big order, but I have been going through a lot of my candles recently and finishing some of them. So there will be space for quite a big order if she introduces some new scents, which I'm hoping she does soon. Although I'm sure, I'm sure she's doing something in around a month's time from when me, when I'm filming this. So maybe in a month's time, we might be getting some really gorgeous new scents, fingers crossed. So that's my little order. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave them down below. If you're new to my channel or you watch my videos but you aren't subscribed, please subscribe. Don't forget to press the bell notification button to get an alert when I upload next. I'll be back very soon. I hope you have a fantastic week. Thank you for watching.